I'm joined by Dylan Bentley from the New Mexico Ice Wolves. Dylan, thank you so much for taking some time to chat leading up to the Robertson Cup. First things first, I want to talk about your advancement through uh, the North American Hockey League. You first played in the NAPHL, then the NA3HL, now here in the North American League. What has the development been like for you? Yeah, I kind of just uh, kind of moved away from home when I was 15 to go play in Madison and just kind of worked up from there. And then when I was done with my 18s, I went to, um, you know, obviously the NA3, went there for a year, developed myself, and then um, uh, was lucky enough to sign a tender with New Mexico and just went up from there. And it, taking things on a personal note this postseason, you've been leading the Robertson Cup playoffs in scoring. What do you think attributes to the success you've had? Well, I think we're having team success, and it's pretty easy to have personal success when you have team success. And um, it's pretty easy when everyone's pulling the same direction, and that's what we're doing here. I like that. And then you guys have also been down in each of the South Division playoff series, but have been able to find a way to come back. What do you think has contributed to it? Yeah, we've been through the adversity that uh, you know other teams haven't been through, and I think it, I think it actually helps that we've been through some adversity. Like last year, we played on the road all season, and I think a lot of the guys um, learned to fight um, last year, and it's kind of just transferred over into this year, and especially in the playoffs. I mean, a lot of the other teams here haven't been through the adversity we have, and um, we just after when we were down, we started to doubt our doubt and really pushed together and really leaned on each other, and that's why we're here. And now this next question I'm going to ask you. I know uh, the initial answer you guys all give. You say you don't have one, but I have found most of the time you guys always do. What are your superstitions before a game? Uh, pretty much, I mean, obviously tape my stick the same way. Um, just a couple things in warm-ups. Um, but I think we, we play this kind of the same music in, uh, before the game, and I think that's – that's kind of a team superstition we have. Kind of one guy plays the music, one guy plays mostly the same songs, whatever's working that day, I guess. Okay, now I have to ask, what music are you listening to, and who's in charge of playing it? <laughs> Will Howard, he's in charge of playing it. Uh, mostly rap, you know, some country, but just mostly a lot of rap songs, just like Eminem. Um, you know, Without Me always is a good one. Lose Yourself, those ones. Is there a guy on the team you would just absolutely not let ever pick the music? Yeah, Benny Halas would be some Hungarian music. Wouldn't even know what it was. Uh, probably him. Okay, okay, that's fair. That's fair. Um, one final thing while I have you here. What would it mean to win the Robertson Cup, not only on a personal and team note, but also for the city of Albuquerque? Yeah, obviously it's huge. We wouldn't be able to do it without the city behind us, especially just kind of how our team is, um, you know, everybody supports us, all of our Billet families support us, a lot of them will be here, and just to win it for those and um, win it for them, and all, then also the guys that have been here for three years, just looking around the room, seeing those guys that have battled for three years to get to this point, it just makes you want to run through a wall for them, and that's kind of the motivation for us. Dylan, thank you so much for your time, and best of luck this weekend. Thanks for having me.